I'm sure that many of you have heard the fun fact that lobsters are biologically immortal, in the sense that they cannot die of old age. Their metabolism never slows down and they never stop growing. Don't get me wrong, they can die, just not of old age. They normally die in the wild through predators and they struggle with their shell, shell health and size as they continue to get older. But if it wasn't for those reasons, they would keep living indefinitely and more important for the video, they wouldn't stop growing. Before I get any more into this video, I want to say that I have done a lot of research on this topic, but I am no scientist or lobster ep experts. If I missed any of the facts in this video, feel free to say so in the comments. Just be straightforward, not a jerk about it. According to Wikipedia, the heaviest crustacean ever recorded was an American lobster caught off the coast of Canada that weighed a little over 44 pounds. The American lobster is the kind you would normally see on TV and in supermarkets. Many of you have seen those lobsters and you know they are not big animals. The lobster caught off the coast of Canada, however, was so big it weighed a little more than a five gallon bucket of water. Other lobsters have been caught which are over three feet long. So assuming these lobsters can stay alive, they will not stop around a meter long. They will continue growing indefinitely. However, given that they do in fact live in the wild, and the wild is normally kind of a screwed up place, these lobsters will be eaten or have shell issues. Hypothetically, however, if you had a captive lobster that was kept away from predators and you helped it molt safely, it is most likely safe to assume that you could grow a lobster to be the size of a human. So if I had to summarize in a TLDR, I would say that lobsters, given the proper care in captivity, could live over a hundred years and grow larger than some of the tallest people on earth. Obviously, they are still lobsters and would not be very aggressive towards humans. It's just normal food or whatever it is fed when it's grown too big that it will attack. Again, I am not a scientist or expert, just a curious dude with a YouTube channel, and I thank you for watching.